Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Final Fantasy VII Rebirth and uh, we finished the challenge, um, the, what, what, do we, what do we call them? Challenge matches of Queen's Blood? Uh, we got the Sephiroth card now, so I'm excited to try and use that. Uh, we need to go and find where we can get the items we're missing. They're on the other side though. We got everything here. Got a big pile of points to trade me? Yep, yeah, we got what we needed here. Make sure to come back. Once you racked up more points. Your trusty guide mobile is at your service. Okay, I think we got the ones at the battle square except for the materia. So I think it was speed square and maybe chocobo square where we Hold needed stuff. Here. Let's go find out. I can't even remember if Chocobo Square has them, but we could also do some races while we're here. Welcome, cadets, to Space Hi, Ranger HQ. Day. Our mission today is a vital one, and we will need your wholehearted support to defeat. Greetings, recruit. Oh, no, we got those. Okay, maybe I was mistaken. Make us proud, Space Ranger. From there. Man, I wish there was a place where all of the stuff you could trade for points was located. Because <laughs> now I don't know where they are. Pretty sure here it was just Materia. We've arrived at your destination. Yeah, so we need 2,500 for that. Don't think I'm going to grind that out. But who knows, maybe if we do the Colosseum stuff, we'll get there. Are you interested in joining the fray? Oh, there's actually a lot. So, level 33? We're a little bit... Yeah, maybe, maybe we'll wait till we're a little bit higher level then. Give us a holler when you want to throw down. We'll come back. All right, Chocobo Square. I'm pretty sure there's a point shop there that we can. That we're missing some stuff on. I don't think Event Square had one, but we might want to double check there as well, because I can't remember. And here we are. Here we go. Okay, there's our jockey card. Oh, it's Chocobo Sam's guy. Thanks, and have a wonderful time. Which of these races will you be competing in? We're all looking forward to your next race. Hey there! You treating your chocobos right? Oh, you sell all of them. Hey, we have enough for that, actually. Cool. Catch you later! Uh, we'll come back. I want to find the rest of our stuff to buy. Let's go to Event Square. Just name the square, and I'll get you there. We've arrived at your destination. Ah, there is. Okay, so this is probably where the other stuff is that we need. Good day, and well met, most esteemed guest. Perchance you have points for me? Check the schedule for more details about our Okay. Here we go. And a loveless card. Okay. So I got all of the must-haves. The level-up material would be like icing on the cake, but I'm assuming there's going to be stuff here later in the game. Um, in the story, I believe there's a moment where we do return here for some more stuff, so. Alright, maybe let's do one Chocobo race, and then we'll go and do some more um, open-world stuff. Have 
Alright, three lap races held on short tracks. Um, let's see, jockey rank, maiden, zero out of two first time maiden race wins for promotion. And then I'm guessing that we'll get access to other stuff. Okay, Carbuncle Classic, Moogle Oaks, Cactuar Derby. Okay, we have our three different chocobo we have access to. Temporarily increase your speed, maintain top speed for long enough to become invincible and knock rivals out of the way. Okay. Enhance your traction and prevent being knocked back during collisions. Once the gauge is full, gain the ability to fire up to three blasts that travel in a straight line. Send any rivals they collide with, really. Let's go with our speed guy, Bell. Okay, we got some traction. Speed, acceleration, weight. Let's do acceleration. Gain a dash charge upon entering the final lap. Let's try that. And effectiveness of dash panels. Oh, I went right through them. My bad. Okay, we're catching up.
All right, good stuff. Okay, let's do Moogle Oaks. What is this song? My bad. Way too late. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> okay, missing those is pretty bad. Okay, nice little shortcut there. Okay, I'd like to gain more of a lead if I can. Almost went too late on that. Oh, we got a good lead during that last lap. Promoted to bronze. All right, we're gonna do this one and then we'll move on to do something else. Back to the open world. We'll try and space out the minigame stuff. Cactuar Derby.
Okay, gets a little dicey around some of those corners. Oh, jeez. Alright, so that'll be it for now on those. Please remember that you are always welcome here, sir. Now that photo, is that something that I need to get in the under the under area of the prison? I don't really know. My guess is that we can get it from here. All right, let's see if we can get that. Birdhouse, okay. And we've got a fight down there. All right, let's just start knocking some of this stuff out. Okay, so there's the prison. Which, which part of this is the scenic part? This thing turns pretty well for being such a big machine. All right, so this thing can go in the water too. And I believe it can go over this stuff, right? All right, cool. There's something beautiful. Hey there. Thank you for tracking down that spot. Quite the view you captured. Very nice. I'd say you're a first-rate photographer now. 
If the association had any lingering doubts about you, this latest shot should have completely dispelled them. At this rate, you'll outrank me. But hey, friendly competition never hurt anyone. Little cage out here, huh? Weird. Search for a transmuter chip that will let you craft bird traps. That's right. Okay. Never mind. Can't do this yet. <laughs> All right. We'll go to this. And then I suppose we'll head to that. And, you know, these will help us find the transmuter chips. Okay. And then there's a bunch of bird houses. All right, let's go for that fiend. Jump, buddy. You know, a lot of these enemies are not lending themselves well to me figuring out how to use uh, Kate. All right, let's fight these guys because we'll be able to use Kate a little bit easier with this. Ah, Sand Daddy. Where is it? Where is my beloved treasure? <laughs> No I'm all about you show us what Leave you got. Okay, what are you weak to? Fire? Okay, so let's ride. Oh, and I guess dodging, I get off of it. And it continues on its own. Okay. Dodge and dive. Fortune tailing. Heat wave, cold front. And was fortune telling a melee attack? Deal damage, great or small, or perhaps just get your fortune told. Okay, that seemed to do a lot of damage. Okay, 
He mastered fortune telling. Uh, which weapon do we like more? The other one had more, yeah, materia slots. So let's go back to that one. Um, really don't know how to use him yet. That was really rough. <laughs> Damn, where'd your MP go, bro? Jesus. Why was that not on Cloud? Why does opening the menu go to Kate first? What? Oh, is he a party leader right now? Hold on, hold on, that was weird. Let me check. No, I'm party leader. So look at this, I open menu and it's on Kate, not me. Why? <laughs> why, why would it ever do that? <laughs> Wasting ether, I'm mad. <laughs> They're kind of limited. Alright, anyways. Yeah, when did it start doing that? See how just a standard cure does. Okay. All right. Yeah. Let's put it back on haste. Cause I do want that to be a thing in this fight. We'll open up by assessing and then hasting everybody. right now. Shoot! Sure. 
Okay, magic mog box. Uh, use the Moogle to lob a box of tricks at an enemy and find out what's inside. Hang back. We barely missed the time limit. Impressive work, Cloud. Using the data from your battles, I've devised a new trial for the simulator. Which I supervised. I think you'll find it to be a most fascinating scenario. So please do give it a try. Okay, so in the third game, they need to replace Chadley. The longer we go through this game, the more I hate Chadley and Mai. Um, I think I saw a comment from somebody at some point, and I don't even remember if it was on one of my videos or um, something else I was watching. It might have been on the MinMax, um, it might have been a MinMax comment. Um, I was watching their Deepest Dive, it might have been on that, but somebody mentioned that, like, it would have been so much better had all of the dialogue that was dedicated to, like, Chadley and Mai if, like, our characters had things to say about all of these things. Like, for instance, like, Aerith could be talking about, um, the live stream wellsprings that we find she could be the one who like illuminated us on those um it could be that red 13 being like a predator he could have been the one talking to us about the hunts like they could have made that more interesting and more personal to the party but instead we just have fucking chadley who nobody likes If you like Chadley, sound off in the comments. So we can point and laugh. I mean, what? <laughs> we wouldn't do that. We respect your opinion. It's kinda. <laughs> When you miss items, it's a little harder to get turned around to get them. <laughs> Alright, I think it's below us. Make the jump! You can do it! Nope. It wouldn't let me. <laughs> um, let's see. Have we unlocked that one? We have not. So slow. It's on you. I'm your host. Whatever. Leave it to me. Come on. I'll make pets be of you. You're tough now. Take it over. Ah! <laughs> Hey, little guy. Oh. Jumping on the sign. You're wild, bro. You're wild. 
Okay, let's give him a pet. Gotta give him a pet. Yeah, we need to go all the way around, it looks like. What is that thing? Look at that. That's cool. Well, I mean, you'll definitely know when you're close to one of these springs, because it's the only green place in this area. A tale of decline. Coal was in high demand in the days of the Republic, and the wealth of Mount Corel drew miners from far and wide. Though the work was hard and dangerous, the laborers banded together to overcome their difficulties, forming a close-knit community in the process. Alas, the advent of Mako saw the price of coal plummet, spelling disaster for the people of Corel. As they struggled to find a way forward, Shinra proposed the construction of a Mako reactor. And after much debate, the villagers accepted the offer. The reactor was constructed with astonishing haste, but just prior to being brought online, it was torn apart by an immense explosion and has been left in ruins ever since. Okay, a desert waypoint. Can't do anything with this until we do more there. Ooh, I wonder if there's gonna... Yeah, it looks like there's a pathway down here. Oh, that's where our quest has taken us. Rundown reactor. Okay, let's go and hit this up next. And if we run into anything along the way, then great. And then maybe we'll head north. Kind of expected that maybe this would be a cache location. Fire actually helped deal with that. Good to go. <laughs> I'll scratch your eyes out. All together now. This one's a showstopper. All done. I do love Kate's voice actor. He's doing a great job. He's such a weird character, I wasn't sure how I'd take him, but so far, so good.
Okay, so three chests in this area. Do we think there's going to be a Moogle house somewhere in this area? Or does the one on the other side of the water closer to Coast of Del Sol count as the one for this area? Okay, there's our tower. Okay, you know I want to drive the buggy down whatever that is. They're nothing. Now. Okay. Come on. It's on now. now. <laughs> Sorry. So the counter fire stops me from being able to counter. Yeah, with those enemies, you can't really use anybody but Cloud. He's gonna always be the most effective against them, I feel like. Just because of that counter and the fact that they stay underground. Still take some decent hits from him too, even when he's countering and blocking, but they move so fast I doubt I could get I doubt I would be good at getting the um immune blocks in. The perfect parries. Here we go. This ends here. Something we can climb up there. Oh, that looks like it might actually be our way up. Okay. Let's go then.
Okay, I think we're gonna head north first. We'll collect this, and we'll work our way towards that. Finish up this area before venturing down into this area. Yeah, I'm continually surprised at how large some of these areas are, man. Okay, let's roll Tifa and Barret for a little bit. He's back. Okay, so that just goes down there, it looks like. Alright, let's follow this guy. And I guess we're gonna do the reactor, and once again, I'm hoping that the challenges are different each time. Oh, you know what? We're gonna have... I bet you it's down there. Okay, so we need to be in the buggy, because we have to go through the water. needs to break anyway. Oh look, it's right there. Okay. Look, another light spring. Okay. So this will probably get us the thing that we need for the side quest too. So this is good. This is good stuff. Oh, sorry. I'm trying to get my dog into my lap and he's uh, <laughs> there. He's good. <laughs> he just needed to find the right way to lay down. <laughs> okay. Okay. Now let's keep moving. Let's look over here. Looks like there's a little, some loots. Man, we're finding all sorts of cash locations. Nice. You know, honestly, we've probably missed a couple of cash locations in some of the open world areas. Like we haven't, we haven't completely explored every single location on every map. You know, guarantee I've missed some stuff. Okay, two chests here. Okay. Ah! Get in the door! Three handfuls of gold dust. Okay, the second one must be out here somewhere. Or could it be up top too? I wonder. Anything climbable. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, so it looks like there's... Whoop, didn't mean to do that. There's a pathway this direction. Yeah, let's take that up and around. And then we can get this, and then we can knock some stuff out. Come here. Oh, nice. So that's where that is. Okay, we can go and grab that along the way, too. We haven't unlocked where this thing is at, but we can follow it. According to legends passed down in Corel. Okay, well then. <laughs> um <laughs> strays from the proper course, Alexander appears to render his righteous judgment. His pronouncements are absolute and cannot be defied. Parents sometimes tell misbehaving children that Alexander might come and smite them if they refuse to shape up. <laughs> Kids, always scared of being smitten. Okay, I have no idea where that's going. Let's see. Keep trying to keep an eye out for... Oh, maybe in here? No. Okay, I have no idea where that was taking us, so we're gonna ignore it for now. I was really hoping I could just make that jump. If any of you saw my playthrough of um, Cyberpunk, you guys know what a great driver I am, and I'm just showing you off those skills right here, right now. Yes, I drive like an insane person. Where are you, Sand Daddy? Don't know where he is. Okay, I think the tower's somewhere over there, right? Let's just go and do... start this first. <laughs> So we don't know what direction that stuff's going to take us either. So we may as well pick this up so that we can start following the cactuar as we continue to explore. All right then, let's start looking for those craggy cactuars. Alright, I bet you were going to whatever this hole is, by the look of things. We do this fast. Fortification material improved. Keep it together. You're up. Feel the heat. Suck on this. 
That way, huh? All right, never mind. It's not going to be that. Right into that one. Watch yourself. Bring it home. I got this. Here I come. <laughs> Bro, what is going on with our camera right now? You're dead. Where's this fiend fight? It's gonna be right in here then. Be on your guard, everyone. I'm picking up a monster signal. It's on you. Rare landworm variant identified. Commencing guidance protocol. Their eyes have long since atrophy. These creatures rely on their sense of smell to hunt. Man, you need MP, bro. I feel like in this game, the MP has been reduced from the previous game. I don't know if that's actually true, but I feel like our MP just in general is a lot lower. Don't overdo it. Okay, ice. <laughs> Forcing them to ingest rocks to break down food and absorb nutrients. Watch yourself. Me, my help, please. Hang back. Hang back. Extreme hunger, however, can drive them to attack the prey. The gold saucer has led to a steady increase in foot traffic, and, as you might imagine, a corresponding increase in landworm related deaths. To protect these travelers, now. we must understand oh, yeah. what makes this very entertaining. Come on! Let's go! Keep it up! This ends here. Ha! Deal with that. Okay, let's go. Yeah, and stay on the Good to get in there. Leave it to me. Keep it up. I know you can Strike. do it. Our mouths are changed. You take them down. Mind over mouth. No fear can strike against you. I'll hang back. Let's do this. Take a deep breath. You can do it. Let me come on. Well fought. So perhaps you could polish off those objectives next time? Cloud, I've analyzed the data from your latest bout and graded your performance. You've earned... a 10 out of 10. Cloud. 
Apologies, my speaking out of turn. Pay her no mind. You get a three out of ten. I what? Those sound like questionable metrics. Never mind. We'll discuss this later. Cloud, I've come up with a new combat trial for you. Why not give it a go? All right. Thank you, Tifa. Okay, down there, Aerith. <laughs> All right, so this is probably the way we need to go, yeah? What do we think? Yep. How's everybody doing on their weapons? Have we... Yep, it looks like we've mastered everything. That's good. Oh yeah, we have to hold it up, don't we? have physical abilities so I don't know if this is let's let's try sorcerer's storm hey, you asked for it. All right, this is not gonna work I warn you sorry to try to get ready He knows what's gonna happen. Ladies first. <laughs> oh no, you're way better at the whole putting yourself in harm's way thing. Fine. <sighs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> Why? Me? Word of advice? Don't fight it. Yes, heed the voice of experience. <laughs> I do to deserve this. <laughs> Let's head back to the reactor.
Cool. You can see the ship from here. Alright, we're going in there in the next episode, so thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next episode. Have a good one, everybody. Bye. I'd like to give a very special shout out to my patron supporters Darren York, ZTD, Knife Namase, Kyle the Monarch, Chris Murphy, JW, Quinless, Vlado101, Andy Ford, Bruce Wizzle, Black Mamba90, Eureka Gecko, A Happy Fat Panda, Turkeyfoot27, Pedo Kuto, Shadow Raven, Anna Kate the Great, The Blue Electric Cat, Emily Kuzanoa, Philip Dalton, Timothy Jansen, Skip, and Nadia N. If you would also like to join this tier or any others, check out my memberships or my Patreon in the description down below.